The UCSC Genome Browser has been widely used by researchers worldwide for more than 20 years. The 2019 outbreak of the coronavirus inspired us to create the SARS-CoV-2 Genome Browser, extending the Genome Browser to SARS-CoV-2 data for use by those wishing to understand the biology, epidemiology, and immunology of the virus. This brief introduction, created by UCSC Genome Browser senior architect Angie Henricks, is designed to familiarize scientists with the basic workings of the Genome Browser and to show some of the data available to explore. At the end of the video, we'll link to resources for learning more. To open the SARS-CoV-2 Genome Browser, click on the link in the video. Or, use the menus on genome.ucsc.edu. When it opens, you will see the entire 29.9 kilobases of RNA in the reference genome and all of the protein products. You can use the Genome Browser to discover the genomic structure of the virus, where the proteins are, and their features, how variants of concern differ from the reference and from each other, conserved domains, antibody binding experiments, and much more. The browser offers a set of coordinates representing the reference genome sequence with data annotation tracks showing where areas with biological significance can be found along that sequence. Anything that can be mapped to a genomic location can be represented on the genome browser and then open to access more information about it. If you hover over an item, you will see a descriptive name. Clicking on the item takes you to a details page, which gives you even more information, including a reference to the source article in the literature. You can view annotations at any level of resolution from the entire genome down to a single nucleotide. You can shift-click and drag over a region of interest to zoom into it. Or you can use zoom buttons above the image. Clicking the gray or blue mini button to the left side of the track opens a page describing the data. Note that often many tracks have extra subtracks that are hidden by default but you can enable them here. Display conventions and the meaning of colors. Another way to explore the available data is to scroll down to see the complete list of available tracks. Hover over a track's title to see a longer title for it and click on the link to view the documentation. To view the track's data, change its visibility setting from Hide to one of several other progressively more expanded modes. To save the exact view you have configured, or bookmark it so that you can see it or share it later, you can store a snapshot as a saved session. To save your current view, navigate to My Data, then to My Sessions. Sign in or create an account. Now scroll down that page to save current settings as a named session and give the session a name. You also have the option to keep a session private. Copy the session link and paste it to share. When someone follows the link, they will see the genome browser exactly as you have set it up. They can then change settings and navigate around without changing your saved session. For more, visit bit.ly forward slash UCSC COVID browser.